Virgos, hey you guys. I will be doing a love reading for y'all. I'm gonna just dive into this. Um, the first card will be your energy. The second one, neutral energy between you and your partner. The third one will be your partner's energy. And the last one, the fourth card, will be the outcome slash overall energy of this connection. Virgo energy. I was about to say Taurus, so you couldn't be dealing with the Taurus. Virgo energy. How are they feeling regarding this connection with their partner? I'm waiting for the collective. How are they feeling regarding okay? Mutual energy. How is the Virgo and their person feeling towards each other? Hmm. The person's feeling. What is it? Right. These cards coming out pretty easy. Um, it's looking like y'all could have had a fight. Some type of fight. What is the overall energy slash outcome? Okay. No worry. What is the neutral energy? What is the neutral energy? The neutral energy. What is your person's feelings? What is your person's feelings with them regarding this connection? Overall energy or outcome. What is the overall energy or outcome? cards came out okay i'll take that oh damn three cards all right let me just take the three and call it a day okay so virgo what i see usually six of wands to me means like victory recognition you see all the people was watching this man on his high horse you know a whole lot of flags it looks like you know a celebration of something but in this deck i'm feeling like you could be moving on or thinking about moving on to gain some type of balance in your life you see the fire and the water trying to balance everything out because the neutral energy is some type of heartbreak or betrayal it could also mean a third party but i'm not gonna get into that but yeah some type of heartbreak or betrayal something going on y'all could have cut communication with each other or um y'all could be wanting to communicate with each other your person's energy this is why i feel like you had a fight because the three of swords the queen of swords and then the seven of wands seven of wands you could see him fighting back all these wands so i guess you and your person might have gotten to a fight um Y'all could have gotten into some type of fight, um, into some type of breakup. The world card is here. So I feel like they look at you as their world. Like they truly feel for you. Or they're happy with you being a part of their world. Despite the arguments and the fighting. The outcome and overall energy, four of swords. So right now, stress that's like the overall energy y'all is both y'all both stressing um but i see y'all working on it because we have the three of pentacles and then we have the eight of pentacles either y'all could be working on it or instead of working on a relationship y'all could be working on y'all money instead of you know dealing with all of this but i feel like y'all will be working on it some of y'all y'all will um y'all will have y'all focus on a craft or a job to you know um drown yourself into something else so you won't feel go through the emotions and some of y'all y'all will work on it because three of pentacles like you could see them both just focused and working they're both just focused and working okay this reading is pretty much getting straightforward i like this <laughs> I think my toughest reading might have been 
I want to say Aries, I think it was. I'm not too sure. But I was like, damn, what the hell was going on? <laughs> it was either Aries or Sagittarius. I didn't even get to... Destruction. Hmm, what is the Virgo feeling towards that person regarding this connection? What is the Virgo feeling towards that person regarding this connection? What is the mutual feeling towards this connection or towards each other? Yes. Okay. What is their person's feelings? What is their verbal person's feelings? These things is just flying. <laughs> what is the overall energy or outcome? These things are just flying. Solitude. Okay, okay, okay. Action. So once again, you're taking action with something. Right here, the horse is moving. You can see one of his legs. The horse is moving, so you're you're doing something. You're taking action. And like I said, it could be trying to balance your emotions, trying to balance how you feel. Fifth dimension came out for mutual energy. So what I feel like is y'all both want each other. Y'all both want to be together. But I guess the argument is coming in the way. But yeah, both want to be together. Contemplation, your person is just... Your person could be indecisive on whether they want this connection or not. Or indecisive of wanting to speak because Queen of Swords is here. Swords represent communication. And you see she's sort of with the shits. She's sort of with the shits. Apple Watch trying to tell me to breathe. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm breathing. <laughs> But, um, yeah, your person, they're thinking about something. Probably thinking about the connection. Um, where it says Four of Swords is the overall energy. So, your person could be up at night thinking about you. Um, for the overall energy, solitude came out. So, right now, y'all could be in separation. Right now, y'all could be just dissessing yourself. So, you know, it, it won't be as many arguments. But I'm going to keep going. Or y'all could be reinventing yourselves. Reinventing is at the bottom of the deck for the overall energy. So y'all could be reinventing yourself. Or reinventing the relationship. Rebranding yourself. The Virgo feelings towards their person or connection. What is the Virgo's feelings towards their person? What is the Virgo's feelings? Offer could be waiting on an apology or you could be the one to give the apology because action is at the bottom so you could be coming with an offer with an apology with some type of compromise or you could be um waiting on an apology just the mutual feelings towards each other okay what is your person's feelings what is the verbal person's feelings what is the overall energy so like i said your energy you're waiting for an offer you could be the one to give the offer mutual energy is the fifth dimension and balancing the skills so like i said right now y'all could just be focusing on yourself and rebranding yourself or y'all could be soon enough coming to communication and um well coming to union and coming up with some type of a promise to make sure you know the relationship lasts in all of that good stuff um your person's feelings contemplation and return so they want to they want to come back to you they're not letting you go you're their world to spite the fights okay so they're they don't want to go nowhere they're thinking about returning it could be them with coming with an offer um but they're thinking about coming back they don't they don't want to go nowhere they don't want to go nowhere now, solitude and observer came out on the bottom of the deck. I mean, on the um, 
overall energy so what i feel like is you or your person or both of y'all could be y'all this reading is giving me a separation um type of vibe so i feel like if y'all are separated y'all are lurking on each other's page y'all can have a fake page one of y'all or both of y'all and just watching each other or you just stalking their stories stalking their twitter stalking their instagram facebook all of that like you're you're watching like you see this person they got their laptop right there and they're like i'm in tune i'm in tune <laughs> and then bottom of the deck for overall energy is commitment so yeah yeah coming back and then at the bottom of that is settling and y'all see me shuffle this y'all see me shuffle this i ain't do this <laughs> okay well i'm going to do one more this reading was pretty straight to the point i'm at what 12 minutes right now and honestly i could just turn it off but i'm gonna give y'all a little more and then i'm gonna give y'all some advice regarding the situation how are they going towards okay Neutral energy, what is the neutral energy of a girl and your person? What is your person's energy? What is your person's feeling slash energy? Oh, what is the outcome? That one is a come out. So I'm gonna put that out. So how you're feeling Virgo is the king of cups I feel like I feel like you do want to give them an offer you're looking at your cup and it's like you do want to give them an offer you do want to give them something give them love and offer something like you don't want to go anywhere either so cross watcher if you're watching this they don't want to go anywhere either empress is the mutual energy so y'all could have a family together y'all could be planning on having a family having a family together or s spoke about it at one point but empress is at the is, is in the mutual energy nine of swords for the virgo's person so once again contemplation goes hand in hand with this like there and goes hand in hand with the um where is it at? With the four of swords. Like they're they're stressing. They're stressing. They're stressing. They thinking about you, they're stressing. Um, for the overall energy slash outcome is ten of wands. So right now, everything is feeling like a heavy weight on your shoulders. Everything is feeling like a burden but that's not gonna last ten of wands that's completion and you see this person they're moving forward so it's not gonna last at all at all an offer is going to be made whether it be the cross watcher to the virgo or the virgo to the cross watcher some type of offer is going to be made and some type of union is going to be made okay angels can i get some advice for the virgo can I get some advice for the Virgo, please? What is going on? What advice do you want them to hear from you through me? What advice is it that you want them to hear from you through me? What does the Virgo need to hear? What does the Virgo... <laughs> What does the Virgo need to hear from you? Okay. The advice here is you've got the power. Use your abilities to resolve the situation. You can do it. So the angels want you to know. Come with that offer of an apology. Come with that apology. Apologize. It's okay. Let go of your pride and ego and apologize. For some reason, summer is significant. Um, everything that you're asking for becomes yours in the summertime. Summer is right around the corner. 
So whether you want it to be a um a real commitment or a family, whatever the case may be, whatever that's been in your head that you've been wanting, it will manifest within this summer. Now, at the bottom of the deck, your desire is within reach. Have faith as everything is working in your favor. So, okay. All I got to say really is pray on it. Pray on it for it to happen, for it to manifest properly and quicker. Um, And yeah, this reading was very thorough. Pretty much, y'all both don't want to let each other go. But the arguments is just so much, so much, so much. But I mean, y'all gonna work on it. I see that. Y'all gonna work on it. So make sure after this video, you FaceTime, call, shoot a text, apologizing. Okay? <laughs> Whether that be the cross watcher or the Virgo, one of y'all better apologize to the other. Okay? Because that's, that's, that's what y'all waiting for. Somebody to let go of their pride and ego. But um, hope y'all enjoyed this video. Like, subscribe, comment, share with your other fellow Virgo friends. And yeah, more to come soon.